Well, you know, Sea Shepherd gets involved on many levels because we feel that uh, we have to operate within all different media. So therefore, we, uh, you know, we have partnership with the surfing industry, the scuba industry, the fashion industry, arts, and, uh, and also in the yachting industry. You know, we're trying to bring people all together. For instance, planting the flag today, Ocean Nation, is to send a message that it doesn't matter what your, you know, your political point of view is, your religious point of view is, or whatever your affiliations are, we all have one thing in common, and that is the ocean. And uh, we don't live on this planet with a dead ocean. So uh, we all have, have a responsibility to do what we can uh, using our own talents and our creative abilities, whatever, no, in whatever line of work we're in, to make the ocean a better place. Well, over the years, we've gotten a lot of, uh, of support from the yachting community, uh, people, sailors, you know, sailors, surfers, uh, scuba divers, all have an interest in protecting the ocean. So I think that the response here today was uh, very enthusiastic. I started out as a, one of the co-founders. I was the youngest co-founder of Greenpeace. And uh, in 1975, we set out to protect whales. And uh, we went out there with this idea of, uh, with Greenpeace, of protesting, of putting our bodies between the whales and uh, the whaling ships. In this case, the Soviet whaling fleet off the coast of California. And uh, the idea that we came up with is that, you know, they're not going to risk killing a human being to, killing a whale, to kill a whale. Because, uh, you know, that's what Gandhi was preaching. You know, you put your life on the line. Well, we got into the position where we were actually doing that, and, uh, but we found out it wasn't going to work that the Soviets obviously didn't have any problem with killing us if that was what it would take to kill their whales. And uh, so they fired over our head and they uh, hit one of the whales and uh, wounded it. And the other whale, the big, uh, the, the bull whale, turned to defend the pod and was also in turn harpooned. And as it was dying, I caught its eye and he came straight towards us out of the water and that the next move would come on top of us to, to actually crush us. And that was a turning point in my life because when I looked up into the eye of this whale, I saw that the whale understood what we were trying to do. That, and then the whale deliberately pulled back and sank beneath the sea and I saw his eye disappear beneath the surface. He died. He could have killed us and he chose not to do so. So that, to me, changed my life and my priorities. I was no longer out on the sea uh, protecting uh, the oceans for people. I was out there protecting the oceans for whales.